We are back in England, Emmanuel College in Cambridge. Well Done Jack was written in 1719. Look at how smooth it is, how everybody is moving to the beat of the music. And the pattern repeats and repeats. In fact, we are starting the whole dance over again. Back to back is the first move. Then they do a two-hand turn one and a half times and face along the line. Back to back yet again and a two-hand turn one and a half times. Then they do something called two changes of a circular hand. Here is what the Scottish dancers call set and link. The working couple leads down through the couple below, casts back up, and two hand turns all the way, and the dance starts all over again. This is the formation of the dance. All the men are on one side of the long set, and their partner is opposite them on the other side. This dance is done in groups of four people. I, the caller, am about to explain the moves in the dance. You pass your partner by the right shoulder, slide right, fall backwards into place. You take two hands with your partner, turn one and a half times, so you are switching places with your partner. And you face along the line to your neighbor. You repeat those moves with your neighbor, back to back with your neighbor, two hand turn one and a half times, and you end up facing your partner across the way. You give right hands to your partner, pull by, and then in that same group of four, you give left hand to your neighbor and you pull by, and you're back to where you started the dance. The next move in the dance is not easily explained, and people look puzzled while I try. Here is the move. You set right two three, left two three, change places with your neighbor. Let's see that again. You set right two three, left two three, Turn over your right shoulder in a clockwise direction, and the number one couple leads through the next couple, comes back to place, and two hand turns all the way, and the dance starts all over again. In this room, we have only 12 people, three groups of four dancers. Usually, the lines are much longer. This is one of the first English country dances I fell in love with, Benjamin's Birthday by Gary Rudman. It is a very easy dance. All the people are just walking to the beat of the music. This turn of the dance is almost over. 
and then the pattern repeats. But this time, only eight people are dancing. There is one couple waiting out at either end of the set. Once the dance has gone through one more time, they will join in and we will once again have all the people in the room dancing. Here are the moves in this dance. Right arm turn your neighbor, come back to place, circle left halfway, turn single over your left shoulder, face your partner across the way, and left arm turn all the way back to place, circle right halfway, turn single over your right shoulder, and everyone is back to original places. The men change places. The women change places. Here is a move you have seen before, back to back with your partner across the way. And again, a move you have seen before. Set right two three, left two three, right two three, and left two three to your neighbor, and here come three changes of a circular hay. Pass right, pass left with your partner across the way, and right, and you start the whole dance all over again. This is a very old dance, or Boggy, first published in 1726. The moves are extremely simple. This turn of the dance is almost over and the whole thing is about to start again. But one couple is waiting out one whole turn of the dance at the top of the set and another couple is waiting out one whole turn of the dance at the bottom of the set. The couples waiting out are about to join in as we start the third time through the dance. I will now explain the moves of this dance. The first couple in each group of four goes through the other couple and casts back to place. They then do a full two-hand turn and are back at their home place. The other couple does the same thing. They come up through the first couple, cast 
back to place, do a full two-hand turn. The first couple crosses the set, goes down the outside, while the other couple moves into their place. The first couple are about to change places with each other, but if they walked straight across, it would be less fun. So they do what's called half of a figure eighth through the other couple. Then we have four changes of rights and lefts, which look a lot like four changes of a circular hay, but with hands. The next turn of the dance is about to start, but each couple is now with a new couple. Watch the first couple. They are about to do a skip change of step for the half figure eight. It is optional, but fun if you want to use it. Mm -hmm. 